Good morning. Welcome back to another video. It's Monday. I took the kids to school a little while ago, came home, put some makeup on. Um, we're gonna go to Home Goods. I have not been in a very long time. I mean, I only really go if I like need something in particular, but I need to do some organizing. I want to do some organizing. The pantry, I think in the last vlog I was telling you guys about that, about how like the upper part of our pantry is just like a mess and it needs to be organized so bad. So I need to do that. I'm just gonna go get some organizing stuff for that and then also maybe some like baskets or something for the linen closet in the dining room. Um, Donnie had put in some shelving in there because it was just like a coat closet and we didn't have like a legit linen closet so he built shelves in there and I have all the sheets and blankets and everything like folded in there but it's just like a mess and I want to try to get it a little more organized so I'm gonna go shopping for some organizational stuff I'll show you guys what I end up getting and then um, that'll be like a separate video that we do organizing in but I made my smoothie I've got that here got my water um, and a lani and we're gonna go to town so let's go see what we can find okay I just got to the parking lot I'm, I've been listening to my friends podcast um, let me pause it mom group dropout is Michelle and Nikki's podcast um, my friend Michelle, hang on, I'm trying to pull it up so you guys can see what it looks like. This is what it looks like. I listen to like all my music and um, podcasts and everything on Spotify, but I think they have it on Apple Music as well. They're hilarious. If you guys listen to Giggly Squad, you guys will like Mom Group Dropout for sure. So definitely check them out. Um, but it's my friend Michelle and then her best friend, Nikki. Um, so I've been listening to that on the way here. I live like 30 minutes from like the city. So there is in this shopping center right here, which you guys have been to this shopping center with me before, but um, it's so good and I hardly ever come here. But when we have videos to film and organization to do, this is the spot. So we've got Hobby Lobby, Sierra Trading Post, which is like, TJ Maxx, but like outdoorsy stuff. Love that store. Um, we have Home Goods, Ulta, um, DSW Shoes, the mall. There's like the entrance to the mall. So all sorts of stuff. TJ Maxx, like all right here. So I'm gonna run in Home Goods first. I'm gonna do some browsing. Definitely looking for organizational stuff, but you just never know. You never know what's gonna call to you. Um, I really want to go in Ulta and get a mascara also, so we shall see my friends. Let's see what we can find. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> it, I came out of the store and it is freezing and pouring down rain. Um, but I got a whole bunch of good stuff. So we're going to go home and I'll show you guys. My car is so loud when I turn it on. It beeps like a hundred times. I said, I told you guys I might go into Ulta and look at mascara, but one store is enough for me. I'm over it. Um, I've done enough, enough peopling. I was thinking of going and getting Chipotle for lunch, but I'm gonna be responsible <laughs> and go home and eat lunch at home because we have stuff to eat there, so I actually did a little meal prep and I can just eat that for lunch instead of going and spending more money because your girl just spent some money at Home Goods. But I think I got a lot of really good stuff for a lot of different things. So let's go home, have some lunch. By the time I get home, it will be lunchtime and I'm starting to be hungry. I just have a little bit of my shake left. I can drink on the way home. I'll show you everything that I got. Let's go. All right, 
I am home. This is everything that I got. Not all of it is for organizing. That's just what happens when you go into home goods, but let's just do a haul. So for Christmas, Donnie got me um, a pan from Walmart that is Pioneer Woman. It looks very similar to this. It's in the sink right now. It's dirty. Oh, all these dishes need to be done, but that one right there. Um, and I found one similar at Home Goods that came with the lid. So I got another one because we literally use that pan multiple times a day. I'm constantly washing it to use it. So Donnie's like, we should get rid of our crappy pans, like this one that I used this morning. This one used to be really good and then it got put in the dishwasher and it just, it doesn't work very well anymore. Um, but this was, I think, $23. So then um, I got a few, so I have a bunch of these types of containers already, but I wanted to get some different sizes just because what we have for snacks and stuff is ever changing. So I got a couple of these, um, like the flip. I, didn't, I don't really care to have them all like matching or like perfect or anything like that. So I got a couple of that size I got one of these big ones and then I got this one for spaghetti noodles specifically because I always buy the giant pack of organic spaghetti noodles from Costco um, and I don't ever use like one whole thing of it at once so I think this will be nice to just have spaghetti noodles in and um, I got two of these baskets for that closet um, not exactly sure what I'm going to do in that closet yet, but I got a whole bunch of stuff. Whatever I don't use, I will return, but I just wanted to have options. Um, okay. So these smaller containers here, I think I'm going to use these for the pantry to like reorganize pantry drawers. I got six of those. These were like all individual ones. Yeah, these are all individual. So I got six of those. And then these, um, I don't know if I'm going to use these for the pantry or for the closet. But these came in a three pack and they're a little bit bigger. I love these clear bins. I'm going to use my Cricut maker and like cut labels for everything and make it really organized. I love, I haven't used my Cricut in so long, but I need to pull it out. So yeah, baskets. Um, I got one, I have one of these already. I got another one because I want to be able to use this for like canned goods in the pantry, I think, um, if they fit. I saw on Pinterest that people were using these for cans, so hopefully that works out. I got a couple of these over the door hooks. Um, I need one for my closet. Our closet in our bedroom is tiny, um, and I need a spot to hang Donnie's sweatshirts that aren't like on a hanger. So I got a couple of these in this like bronze color because all the doors in our house are dark brown. So I got two of those, one for the closet, and I think I'm going to put one um, on my bedroom door also, like the back side of my bedroom door possibly. But they're different styles, but the same like bronze color. Um, this is random, but we needed some sponges, so I got this two pack of sponges. Um, we are constantly needing bag clips for like snack bags that get opened and I hardly ever, like we have like three of them and they're always being used. So this giant pack of spring clips. Got some stainless steel cleaner. My favorite stainless steel cleaner is the CLR and I usually get it on Amazon, but I really like this one also. And it was $4.99, so I got some of that. And then I got some granite cleaner for the kitchen. This stuff is good. I like it. But I got this for my bathroom. Look how pretty that, like, detail on the front of that distressed wood is. I got this for my skincare in the bathroom. I usually keep my skincare on or in the bottom drawer in my bathroom. <laughs> but I, like, that's where I'm supposed to keep it, you know? Like, down here. But it always just ends up sitting on my counter right here. So I'm gonna put this on the counter and just keep my skincare in that. So then it just looks a little bit neater. So then, oh, here's that other one. There's six of those. 
Um, this is also random, but we only have like two spatulas. <laughs> One of them is metal and it can't be used in those like nice non-stick um, pans like this one. So this two pack of spatulas was $6.99. So I got that and I love that color. And then another one of these baskets. So they're actually a little bit different, which I didn't notice until I was like at the check stand paying, but I mean, it's fine. So anyways, that's everything. I am going to eat some lunch and um, by the time I'm done doing that and like putting some stuff away, I will probably have to go get the kids from school. I need to do the dishes. So that way then tonight, the kids can do their dishes after we cook dinner. But anyways, I'm gonna have some lunch. I'll check in with you guys later. All right, I need my tripod, but I um, ate my lunch, finished listening to the podcast I was listening to, and I'm gonna get these dishes done real quick before I have to go start picking kids up from school. Um, I'm gonna do these dishes, kind of clean up the kitchen a little bit, and then put my skincare on that little tray that I got. Then we'll get the kids from school. Do you wanna go out? <laughs> it's cold. I'm. <laughs> Oregon is so beautiful, you guys. It is absolutely stunning. But it's freaking cold from the end of October until like the middle of June every year. And I highly dislike that. When it's like 70 to 85 and sunny, that is when I'm thriving. The gray and the cold and the rain is getting to me. I've lived in Oregon since 2004. Moved from Tennessee in 2004 to Oregon. And I've never gotten over it. Get dressed and then we 
face and say goodbye You start to get dressed and then we cry Cause we both know it's gonna hurt But not as much as this does I wish I would have gotten one of these little trays sooner. It's literally perfect. Perfect. Hi, good morning. I forgot to end the vlog yesterday. So I'm gonna do it now. Um, we got to sleep in today because the kids don't have school. Surprise. We were not expecting this, but hello. We've got probably two inches of snow. I know, not crazy, but when it snows here, in the Willamette Valley, they usually shut down school because it just this is this happens like one time a year. <laughs> Here, it's not like an all winter thing, so pretty crazy. It's beautiful, but I am not a fan of the cold. <laughs> so we're gonna take it easy this morning. I just got the kids breakfast. Um, I need to take a shower. I need to wake up. And then we will get bundled up and go outside and play. But thanks for hanging out with me. I've got all that organizing stuff just sitting in the hallway over here. I'm going to start working on that tomorrow. I'm just going to enjoy the day with the kids today. But thanks for watching and I will see you again in my next video.